Welcome back to the channel. I'm Nate. I'm Swizz. And we are talking 2K League uh, shooting guard builds here today. Um, there's eight shooting guard builds. I think there was only five last year. Yeah, I think so. So we have three new builds. Um, we're going to go over them and then want to hear what you guys think about them too. So first up, offensive threat. All right, let's see what we got here, Swizz. All right, so this feels good. Like I like this one. <laughs> I like uh, it a lot too. It's quick. It can handle the ball. Play a little bit good defense. It can drive, shoot. It can do a little bit of everything. Yeah. Like really, the, I mean, its weakest point is probably shooting. I mean, you got silver range, so that kind of hurts. At a least Hall bit. of Fame quick draw though, which but is Hall good. of Fame quick draw is like, great. Hall of Fame shoot is great also. Yep. Uh, so I mean, it, it could shoot. Definitely yeah. can shoot, but like. An yeah. 81 3 in uh, the league build is definitely a bit different than retail. It's a lot harder to make things. It's a so. lot tougher to hit threes in this yeah, build, guys. That's so that's going to take in mind so, also. Yeah, so when you're looking at the three point shot, you might be like, oh, that's really greenable, but the, the build is a lot more difficult to shoot, so it's all relative. Right. Um, and we can compare it then to the 6 5 scoring machine, right. which these, is 10 pounds lighter. Right, because these both builds both have. Uh, uh, the max pie chart in uh, shooting and finishing, but they're yeah. just a little bit different in each. Like this build's better at shooting than the other build, yeah. and this build's worse at finishing than the other build. Yeah, we can flip back and yeah. forth between the two. And it's like this one gets like gold difficult shots, gold yeah. green machine. The other one has corner specialist, if that really. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. So like it's just little tweaks. I mean, little a better three things. pointer on yeah. this one too. It's, it's about your player's preference if yep. they'd rather shoot better or drive better, really. Yeah. So that's what kind of is different this year than past years. You actually have more variety it, on things to choose. Yeah, it feels like a lot more variety. And then two, the badges too. So this has right. oh, yeah. the sharp, sharp badge, badge. Which, and, and then I think this the one has slasher. slasher. Yeah. So that's something to take in mind too. I'm a fan of the slasher I badge. Like the slasher I've always badge. been yeah. <laughs> yeah, we know you like the slasher. <laughs> I've personally always been a fan of the the slasher badge better so that's like a big deal for me when you're talking about bills and, and we're still so early in this and we're labbing stuff out so we're trying to figure out right. what works and what doesn't but um early on both not bad builds now this is i can talk about this one a little there bit this go. is this, this is the the two-way finisher right here guys so this is a uh, we call it a lock build um it's only got 73 and with how tough it is to shoot and bronze quick draw don't forget about that and even more importantly bronze quick draw which is slow as heck <laughs> to shoot with um which I'm sure you guys already know, but this build right here, it's gonna get a lot of bump. It's got 90 speed, right. 81 perimeter defense, ha intimidate on Hoff, clamp on Hoff, pickpocket on gold. It's gonna get a lot of bump, but. And the thing um, is booming. Look it, at the finishing badges. Dude, gold contact, gold fancy, gold yeah. giant. Or I mean, not even yeah. gold, there's a Hall of Fame. Yeah. Like these, this build could really. Uh, Hoff fancy go to the rack. footwork. It's gonna be able to finish well with the rack. It's gonna be able to play a lot of defense, and but it's not gonna be able to 10 shoot. 10 seconds to shoot a three. Yeah. So. <laughs> Yeah, so that's the that's the hit that build takes pretty hard. Yep, and three. Then, and then we got a good a little yeah. pierce sharp yeah, at little, the two. A three level score. Yeah, ninety four three. Yeah, so this build can, this build can shoot. It's it's quick too. It's a very quick pierce sharp. The the bad thing about this build though is like so all the heights change in the builds that shooting guards are actually on every. I think no, but I think that that's important to note though. Yeah, yeah for sure. But, so this one is the shortest build at the shooting guard at six four. So it's basically a point guard at the shooting guard spot kind of. And uh, but yeah, that's definitely the biggest problem with this build. But it, I mean, hey, this build can shoot, lights out. It could have some playmaking. It's not going to be able to play much defense. Nah, defense it's seventy-two low. perimeter defense, seventy-five lateral, but everything else is like fifties yeah. and thirties. It's not going to be able to rebound, but you might not need it for that. So again, it's early. We're still trying to figure it out, but this is a pure sharp sort of build. It's going to be able to shoot the crap out of the ball. And that's it. <laughs> yeah, literally, literally. All right, shot creating sharpshooter. All right. 6'5", 185 with the shot creating takeover badge. Um, early thoughts, it's, it shoots pretty well and it, it's almost like a pure sharp that can put it on the ground, right. but it's not going to really shoot bit as of well. And a little bit of better finishing. With right. just a little bit, yeah, so. It, um, the thing about this build is just like, it's like good. Like, what don't you like about this build? I think it's the, it's like the finishing that like kind of takes yeah. you back. And the bad, I don't like the shot creating badge. The shot creating uh, badge, I'm not a fan of because it's really hard to get that takeover up, especially I think in Pro-Am. Yep. Because taking drifters and stuff it's is not really the most tough. ideal thing. Yeah. So like that, like when are you ever going to really ever be able to pop your badge with this build is my uh, problem, yep. I think. But besides that, I mean, the attributes are great. Like it can dribble, it's got Hall of Fame quick first step, it can shoot. But yeah, it's that, uh, I think it's really the shot creating badge that, uh, 
yep. that's it for me. Yep, I think that's it. And the shot creator, <laughs> uh, six six. I don't know if I. This is. I think it's the three point shot that really hurts. It, 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 it's like you're not getting a bang for your buck with right. a seventy seven three pointer um, and, on a six six shot. And it goes back to the shot creating badge. I think also like it's yeah. hard to get that takeover in pro am. Like, yeah, I think it's like the, the we're worst. Like park, yeah, if we were playing park, these builds would be the these two builds would be amazing. I'm, I'm, you're cheesing in park, <laughs> right? I'm telling you, cheesing, <laughs> cheesing. But, but but in in league build, yeah. pro am, whatever. This sort of build with the shot created takeover, not enough three pointer, right. um, not great defense, not great playmaking. Like I don't think you could speed boost or anything. I, it, it just doesn't excel enough in the right category. No, program. it's too like level yeah. at everything. But again, we want to hear what you guys think too. Right. So True. we're just we're just this is our point of view on things. Um, and then I can talk about this we're one a little a bit. Lot, we got we got the sharp defender six five one ninety. I use it a little bit. Um, yeah. I, I personally let me just I'm gonna sneak into this there one real quick yeah. just so I can compare the two so i can i think okay so here's my issue with this one right as a lock i don't want to sharp that head just right. a lock that's a big i'm telling you guys that's a big thing yeah. um it's got great shooting half quick draw amazing shooting. half catch and shoot gold corner gold dead eye all that's great the defensive badges are pretty good they're actually really good and the speed is pretty good for like a sharp lock yes. um but I like this one much better, which is the two-way sharpshooter 6-6. Six, six. If I'm playing lock at the two um, in the league build, pending any crazy changes, this might be a build you see me use. So um, formidable shooting, 80 shooting. And it's got a Hall of Fame corner. Hall of Fame corner, Hall of Fame catch and shoot, gold dead eye. The defensive badges on this build are unbelievable from gold interceptor, gold intimidator. You guys can see it. Um, still got Browns downhill, not bad. A little bit better speed. A little bit better speed, 90 speed. The defensive attributes are pretty good. Um, and it's like I said, it's got the lock badge. Yeah. So to me, at the two, this is the go-to I, I, lock. I think this is the best lock also I, out, of the, out of the group. I, I, I agree. So, um, yeah, but we want to hear your guys' thoughts. So we're going to have you guys vote uh, somewhere in the description. Yeah, there'll be a link in the description. There'll be a link in the description for you guys to vote because we want to hear what you guys think is the best shooting guard build. Um, yeah, and until next time, I'm Nate. I'm Swiss. We'll see you guys later. Peace. Oh, man. Okay, good. Are we good? Yeah, we just have to finesse something. Uh-oh. Later. Go so, so go. Yeah, you're right. good. You're good. What's going on, guys?